Yes, I'm back. Right now, I'm talking about how the white supremacist media plays a major role into white supremacy. Now, some of y'all seen a story I did a couple of days ago on that evil albinoid cave devil who was planning a Columbine style massacre at her school. For April 5th. And I told y'all in my video before that. April is the white supremacist holy month. And. The white supremacist. The white supremacy system is on its last leg. So the white supremacists are going crazy. And now even their women. Are willing to martyr themselves. For the religion of white supremacy. And. The media plays a big role in it because every time the suspect is one of theirs, they either, one, try to conceal the fuck out of their identity, don't show it, because there's no media outlet that's showing this bitch face, except for MelanoidNation.org, and that article is in the description. Shout out to Melanoid Nation. Y'all need to regularly check that site out and donate it. To it as well, especially if you're a person of melon. And they weren't trying to give out her name, but we 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 found all that. You know how we do. We dig. So this bitch name is Nicole Severio. She's a grown ass woman. Number one, she's eighteen. Because every time the suspect or the victim's black, this grown man. Committed a crime or Tamir Rice. Oh, he was big. We thought he was a man. That that she that was a big boy. Then oh, you can't blame the officer. He was big, so we thought he was a grown man. Every time the suspect or victim is black, he's a grown at Trayvon Martin. He was a man. Mike Brown. He was a man. You know, when it's one of theirs, when it's Nicole Severio or that moist white boy who. Went to that different country and robbed the store and then lied and said he got robbed. And I forget that fuck cracker's name. He was, I forget his name. He was in his 30s, though. And they were talking about, well, he's just a kid. Kids make mistakes. A grown-ass man in his early 30s. A damn kid. Then, the media on that bullshit, like they always are. Because they are always complicit with white supremacy. Saying, well, she's a teen student, a honor student. Every I'm telling y'all, every article about this bitch is either she's a teen or she's a good. She was a good student. That is the rhetoric in all the white supremacist articles about this terrorist. They're not calling her a terrorist. So now they, I don't even think this chick is even in jail right now because they said they're gonna put her in a. A psychiatric uh, asylum because she's not there all the way. I call bullshit because she was there all the way to get on a damn honor roll. She was there all the way to make fucking pipe bombs, buy flammable fluids, get shotguns. So, which one is it, white supremacists? Which one? Because first you're saying she was an honor roll student. Now you're saying she's not all the way there. You can't have it both ways. So which one is it? And the white supremacist, they is mad on Twitter. They is butt hurt that we revealed her identity. Why would you do that? Why are you doing this? You're playing a race car. You're a race baiting hustler. Shouldn't you want to know who the terrorists among us are? Because if she was from ISIS or Islamic or... She was from fucking Israel, or if she was black, because Muslim is black or synonymous, the face would be plastered everywhere. We all would it would be trending on Twitter. It would be trending on all social media outlets. But now, since it's white, you know, we got to sweep this under the rug and say she's not there psychologically. And mind you, they did try the same bullshit with Dylan Roof. Understand, they tried that same bullshit with Dylan Roof. But, well, he's not there all the way psychologically. He needs something. Dylan Roof had to fucking 
flat out begged him to not go lenient on him. He's like, oh, no, no, no. I'm there all the way. I knew what the fuck I was doing. I'd do it again. I wanted to shoot up more churches. Dylan Roof was like, I'm taking one for the team. Don't baby me. See, that's what they do. They baby these white supremacist terrorists. Dylan Roof was the only one who wasn't going for the fuckery, though. He was like, no, no, no. I have martyred myself. I am the Jesus of white supremacy. He had to beg them not to go lenient on him. He kept. They kept saying, no, you're not all the way there. Yeah, I am. No, 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 you're not. No, Yes, the fuck I am. I'm a white supremacist. I'm a white extremist. So we got to be on. We got to be mindful of that. The games they play. It's a game, man. We need to be mindful of that. And you so-called non-racist white people, you ought to be mad too. That they're not showing you who the terrorists are. Y'all was probably hanging out with this chick, the people who live in their area. White women probably, y'all probably having sleepovers. This bitch got a fucking grenade in her under her pillow. You should want to know. Brothers too, because Negro's like a chunky little ain't shit white bitch. That's what she is. She a little chunky little hoe. Brother trying to get at that. She got a fucking pipe bomb up her pussy. You, you should want to know this. And another thing, I've seen another, it's, this shit is, this shit is trending now. I've seen another, a new video came out of a sister getting her ass whooped by one of these agents in one of their ain't shit beauty supply stores. And black people just sitting around recording, hey, hey, don't hit her, that man up. You gonna get paid. Just on that coon shit. Stop recording and screaming and praying and start whooping these agents ass. Black people, collectively, we so damn weak. Now the agents is acting like race soldiers and white supremacists. Well, they're honorary white supremacists. Because that's who the torch is going to be passed to once the white supremacists die out. That's why they're having these half of babies. Because understand, as a matter of fact, I'm going to break that down in my next video. I ain't going to get too deep in that. I got a video coming about the reason why Tommy Lauren got terminated. Because she got off white supremacist code. But, number one, we shouldn't even be shopping with the bullshit-ass agents. You don't need that chicken fried rice, whatever dog cat food they chopping up and cooking for you. You don't need crunchy-ass weaves and nails. See, we, we fucking value nigga trinkets over our damn dignity. You letting agents whoop your ass now. You crying to the agents, begging them for apologies. They ain't apologizing for shit. Because really, if we let the agents take over, if we go into agent supremacy, that's going to be ten times worse than white supremacy. Because the agents super outpopulate the white supremacy. They probably damn near outpopulate us. Well, no, nah, I ain't going to say that. Cause we, we always going to be the global majority. The agents, there's a lot of motherfucking agents in the world. They be quick fucking and I don't know how the fuck they populate so well. But you, we can't be letting Asians whoop our ass. Black people, if you see any, especially a sister, if you see a sister getting her ass whooped by Asians, you grab a brick, something, and bust that motherfucker right in his fucking Chinese ass skull. You better fucking Kung Fu, Bruce Lee kick to the jaw, something. Can't be letting Asians whoop your ass. Fuck these Asians. They about 5'2". The men, and it's mostly my. It's mostly the men who are doing this. I've been seeing grown ass aging men beating up on sisters. We can't. You, you, you got to put the charge of that to the game. You can't be letting that shit slide. As soon as we start letting that, then other groups are going to do it. It's, you already know the Hispanics don't fuck with us. They they lie talking about the brown and brown, black and brown coalition. We in this together. They be lying. They don't fuck with us. You can't let agents do that because then these other groups are going to try to whoop on us. Fuck that. You just start whooping ass. But um, I just thought I'd share that with y'all. Because the media, they be full of shit. And I like exposing the white supremacist media every time I get. So like I said, the link's in the description. I'll get in the comments. Like, subscribe. Share the video. I love y'all.